What's up everybody, my name is Garlean here, and I am bringing you my first ever video. Yes, that's right, I'm going to be playing Minecraft. But, here's the thing. I've never played single player. Well, I have, but I haven't played recently. I've only been playing either Hunger Games with Chris, or I've been playing on the LAN server. I really don't play single player Minecraft at all. So, this is going to be my first time ever. So let's start this off by naming this uh, series, I guess. Let's go with that. Uh, I don't need any of that random stuff that they give you. So, this is my first ever video, and I'm here letting you guys know that I'm so happy to start. And, uh, honestly, this is my first time ever really playing Minecraft with this, this clear graphics. Because... As you, some of you might know from the streams, I got my computer yesterday, and uh, I'm so happy with it. This is the first time I've ever gotten, like, a computer that can run games really well. So, I thought, why not start recording? I've got a few subscribers already, and that's from me not having any videos. And I've also got a lot of friends on Facebook from mostly from uh, Chris and the Mike's subs which I am part of. I love Chris. He's my biggest inspiration right now. And most of his subs are really really supportive. They have been uh pushing me to make my own videos and here I am. I'm just this is going to be my series to get to know you guys and for you guys to get to know me. I'm going to be telling you guys stories from like when I was a kid. Uh, and you guys can tell me your stories when you were kids, too. I really want to know about you guys, because I love reading the comments. I love going through and seeing what you guys have to say. All that stuff, you know? So, let's get started. So, as you guys might know, this is Minecraft, and the first thing you gotta do is cut a tree. But you guys don't need to know that stuff, do you, huh? Well, I'm gonna tell you anyway. So, cut the tree make a pickaxe. Actually, no, you can't make a pickaxe yet. You gotta make a crafting table, right? You gotta make that crafting table. Uh, and start off with everything. I will be doing other series as well as, uh, this. I can do anything you guys want me to do. Uh, when it comes to, like, Hunger Games or it could be Ace of Spades. Anything Chris has done, I can probably do. Not saying that my computer is any or close to Chris, or my commentary would be anywhere near Chris, but it'd be nice to, you know, have some content other than Minecraft, right? Uh, I really liked uh, playing on the Shopo network servers. Those things are awesome. That's where we play Hunger Games and everything. Hold on. <coughs> Sorry. I'm gonna be doing that a little bit. I'm starting to get sick. Chris got me sick uh, through one of his videos. So, I want to know, this is the first episode, so, you guys are going to tell me what you want to know about me, and I'm going to, you're just going to tell me about yourselves. Tell me, I don't know where you're from, how you found my channel, probably most of you found me from, like, watching Chris or something, but that's awesome. You know, having Chris there to support me is great. Having people supporting you in what you want to do, and this is something I really want to do. I've always wanted to make YouTube videos, ever since I started watching YouTube when I was like 13, and I'm 18 right now, so I waited this long to make videos because I don't really like my voice too much, uh, it cracks a lot, <laughs> as some of you have already noticed, uh, yeah, but, you know, I figure this is a really good way of trying to work against that trying to work against uh, my issues when it comes to my voice. So, there you go. That's my, that's one story right now as to why I'm starting YouTube. One would be because Chris had inspired me to make videos. Another could be that this is just a great way to improve self-confidence and to be able to talk to people that you don't know. Especially the people that have been supporting you since the very beginning. Because most of you know me from Chris, right? So, 
you should be familiar of what kind of commentator I might be, because I do stream with Chris a lot. I'll be streaming with him every weekday from, uh, what was it, 4 to 5? This is standard time? I don't know, I'm way off on my times, because I'm on Eastern time, he's on Pacific time. And I may sound like really hyper right now. That's because I'm really nervous, and like you can hear my voice is shaking and everything. <sighs> so any suggestions you guys could have to like make me stop or something like that, just to calm me down, make me feel as if I don't know, maybe you like me. <laughs> Kidding. Uh, but yeah, that'd be nice to be able to read the comments and see how you guys react to my first video. How I oh, it's really dark. My bad. Sorry. Hey, first time. Uh guys couldn't see. My bad. Sorry. Um, but yeah, I'd really like to talk to you guys through anything. I mean, you can add me on Steam. You can add me on Facebook. I do go through Facebook a lot just to see like who's new, who's just added me, and uh, if they're friends with Chris and Carlo, because I'm friends with Chris and Carlo on Facebook as well. Although, they don't really use theirs that much. I use mine a lot. Chris uses his to like make uh, announcements along with his Twitter, which I don't use. I don't use my Twitter at all, uh, or my Instagram, because I don't know. I was forced to make an Instagram. Don't ask me how I was forced. <laughs> but yeah, I'd really enjoy to talk to you guys and see just what you guys want to see as a series. Uh, okay. So now that I'm out of that cave, finally. Uh, I can start... I can't really start doing anything, can I? No, I didn't get any iron. Darn, that sucks. Oh. Uh, this seems like a nice flat area. So let me make a small little base around. Put it here. There. Work of art, isn't it? Some people get really mad at, like, really small houses. Uh, I like it. Especially little small square houses, but we can add on to it. You guys can tell me what kind of, uh, if you want to see me build, or if you want to see me mine. I could always fast forward the mining or just cut it out completely. Although, I really don't know how. I'll probably ask Chris or Carlo or Picarden <laughs> to tell me how. But, you know, that's the learning experience of being a recorder. Trying to entertain you guys is going to be really hard for me. <laughs> Cause I'm, I once I get out of my shell, you guys might like me. I'm not sure, but for now, I'm really nervous, and uh, I can even hear it in my own voice that I'm shaking. Uh, but you know, I'm having a lot of fun making this, cause I'm gonna be able to talk to you guys nonstop. Pr actually, no, that sounds really bad. You guys can talk to me whenever you want, and uh, if you have any questions about me or. Uh, anything, just ask me in the comments, like, how I record, I record using fraps, of course, how I edit, uh, this is actually my first video, so I'm probably going to be using the YouTube editing uh, thing, uh, I need to do a lot of stuff, like, with being a YouTuber, there's a lot of work you have to do, editing takes forever, rendering takes forever, all that stuff, and, you know, most people don't take that for granted. Like, I didn't know that Chris had to spend so long editing and rendering his videos to make them all mm. seem really entertaining, right? So I just went in and I'm like, oh, okay, hi Chris, what's up? And then he's re <laughs> sitting there rendering a video, and I felt like, oh, I guess he's ignoring me, I might as well leave him alone. But in all honesty, he was working really hard to make videos. Uh, but I'm glad, I'm glad he's there for me, I'm glad he's going to, uh, he's very supportive, he was very happy when I got my computer, especially everybody was, I was, I was especially me, I was super happy, like, I, <laughs> oh my goodness, I was sitting there with the box, I didn't know what it was, I thought it was like some random piece of garbage that somebody had sent me, like, I don't know, family usually sends me like weird stuff. Like, I got, like, a pinwheel one year. <laughs> so weird. But, yeah. I, I got this in the mail. It was a huge box. Huge, heavy box. 
and I was like, what is this? I don't know what this is. I thought it was like weights or something, because like as a joke from my brother. But, uh, you know, I kept opening it, and I'm like, ah, no, this can't be the computer I ordered a couple days ago. This can't be it. I, I just ordered this, like yesterday. So I kept on going. I kept opening the box, wondering, what am I going to do? What, what is this? What is this? Uh, come on. It has to be like something stupid, right? And once I saw that it was the computer, I almost fainted. I was sitting there, jaw dropped, not not lying here. I was going to faint right there. I looked at my mom, and I'm like, oh my god, is this what I think it is? And she's like, yeah, it is. You know, like, oh, oh, this is the first time I've ever been able to play something so nice. It took forever to install like drivers and everything for it, because especially Windows, I get really confused with the Windows thing, because uh, I used to run off of wireless, and uh, I used to have Windows Vista, and Windows Vista accepts like old uh, D-Link wireless things. I don't know what they are. I don't know most of the, uh, this technological stuff. Uh, but it used to run off of D-Link, this little wireless adapter, and it was completely fine. But, uh, I changed it to this one, and the driver wasn't accepting it. I was, I was so confused. And I was like, what's happening? Am I, am I installing the drivers right? So I installed all the drivers again, which took another, like, two hours, and, uh, installed Windows again. I messed up installing Windows the first time, that's why I installed Windows again. But I kept doing uh, the D-Link, and it didn't work. So I went up to my dad and I said, what's wrong with this? And he's, he said, let me test it on my computer. And he has Windows 7 as well. So he tested it on his, and it didn't work either. So I guess the problem was with Windows 7. And uh, so I, uh, he said, go find a uh, yellow cord so I can connect my computer to the internet using this other little D-Link thing, but it's this one's more recent so it's more compatible with the Windows 7. Uh, so I got, I went to look for a, a yellow cord, one of those little cables that connects the internet together. I went to go look for one of those and uh, to no avail. <laughs> I found, I found one, but this one was completely like chewed up and broken by my uh, dog that I had a long time ago. Uh, I don't have a dog anymore. I have two cats. I love my cats. But I don't know why I just made that. <laughs> no, I need to make a home. Um, yeah. I had, um, the dog had chewed it up, like, completely. And it was, I couldn't fit it inside the thing. So I was kind of sad. I was like, oh no, what am I going to do? I don't have uh, anything to actually fix this with. So I just decided... Uh, you know what? Fine. Uh, let me go ahead and... I don't remember what I said. I asked if I could take the, uh, the router and just put it in my room. And, yeah, my dad said, yeah. So now I'm hooked up, com like, directly to the wireless. Not the wireless, to the router. So I have, like, direct internet. Which I'm happy for, too. This is really cool, because <laughs> I don't lag at all. It's great. Uh, the only problem is, like, after a certain time, I'll switch out the uh, the router because we don't have another yellow cord, so my dad doesn't have internet, so we need to go out and buy a wireless thing uh, to fit for me, or to fit for him, actually. Or another one of those cords so we can hook it up from the f to my computer, to the router, and then to the D-Link thing, so that he can connect, too. But, uh, I'm really glad that my dad made that sacrifice. <laughs> of his internet for mine. It's really cool. I love it. My dad's really nice. Um, I don't remember where I was, but I guess this is a good point to leave off. Uh, I didn't really check how long I was recording for. Uh, this was just supposed to be a quick video of telling you guys that I'm going to start recording and I want you guys to leave comments, leave anything you can, I love reading your comments. Bye!